Macca's Guides. <laughs> Hey, what's up guys? Mac here playing Saints Row Gat Out of Hell, showing you how to get the gnarly wave achievement slash trophy for car surfing on a comet while it explodes. First off, I will be showing you how to do this solo, and then I will be showing you how to do it in co-op, which I think might be a little bit easier, but I know a lot of people like to do these things on their own because finding a co-op partner can be quite difficult. Now, what you're going to want to do is get onto the highway from wherever you are and sprint on the highway until you find this car. This is what a comet looks like. It is a small two-door hatchback. You're going to want to stand in front of it and make sure you don't uh, blow it over with uh, any of your running or your shields or your guns. And you're going to need to car, car surf on it. Now, there's like a 50-50 chance that it'll explode as you're car surfing. Sometimes it will, sometimes it won't. In this scenario, you can see that I ended up car surfing on it for almost 20 five seconds and it did not explode and it wasn't even really that close to exploding so I ended up running a few loops around the highway and about five ten minutes later yeah it takes that long sometimes to get these guys to spawn they're quite rare I found another one stood in front of it jumped on top as it starts moving you'll see a vehicle surfing button on screen so you're gonna want to press the prompt and then you're gonna want to balance yourself as long as possible and if you get lucky It'll hit something, it'll it'll light on fire, it'll get exploded by an enemy. Something will happen that will cause this car to explode. Now, this car is different from the other cars. It actually naturally does want to explode. It damages itself very, very easily and will explode very, very easily. As you see, it explodes here for almost no reason at all. Um, and then I unlocked the achievement. I actually had the achievement from doing it in co-op, but that would have unlocked my achievement had I been doing that for the first time in solo. That's how you can get it on your own. Here is the co-op method. You want to take a peek as to where my character is on screen. There's a set of two parking lots on the road that I'm currently standing on, and you can run back and forth with your co-op partner and try to get a vehicle to spawn. What your goal is, is to find um, a comet, and your goal is for one person to get into the comet, and then the other person will start car surfing. Now, the uh, person inside the car, their goal is to try to get that comet to explode without, like, running into a wall, because that'll throw the surfer off. So, as you see, I'm surfing on this car right here, and what we did was we slowly drove into some lava while I was car surfing, and that's it. That's how I ended up getting it, and then we traded off, and I did the same thing in reverse for my friend. Now, the reason I showed you the place I was doing this on the map was because there's two parking lots where you can run back and forth to get a comet to spawn, although it can take 5 to 10 minutes. But there is also a small patch of lava right next to the parking lots, which work well for you. Yeah, you don't really want to drive this car off a cliff into the lava because the vehicle surfing um, might get interrupted and then the car might explode. You don't want to lose it. Now, as you can see, as I'm using the car here, it is burning up just from standing there not doing anything. Um, so as long as someone's on it vehicle surfing and they can stay on it for as long as possible, it should just naturally want to explode. Driving it into the lava just makes it happen immediately and makes it unlock the achievement or trophy for you guys. Hopefully that was a helpful video. You can do it solo by running around the highway or you can do it co-op with a buddy and just driving them around. Thank you for watching and hopefully I see you in the next video. Peace!